Uh, you know, I thought we did a good job, and then we try to give it back to them. Uh, hopefully, that's a learning experience for some of them. Um, I thought uh, Bray Holmes, you know, naturally come out and was very aggressive attacking the rim. So I thought she did. Bray McDonald did a good job attacking the rim. Avery had a double double again. Good to see, you know, but. Gave up way too many offensive rebounds. We got 28. That was really good, but we gave up 17 and 19 turnovers. But, uh, you know, I, th I thought when they cut it to four, we settled down a little bit and then was able to get it back. I think we got it back up to nine. So that was good to see. Coach, it looked like, especially in the first half, we really came out aggressive when we're getting those loose balls and really getting after it. What did you think of the, the just the energy overall tonight? I thought we did. I thought we come out and played hard. Uh, I mean, honestly, I thought there was a couple times ball was on the floor. We didn't get on the floor. But I, overall, I thought we played hard. I thought people attacked. People were aggressive. And then, you know, when they started making the run, you know, what we didn't like was we, we weren't aggressive anymore. We were tentative. And then we started turning it over. We, we took some bad shots during that stretch. Needless to say, Linda was out. And then Jess went in there and, you know, got a little bit out of control. But, you know, and then, and then I tried Dom there at the point. And then I just said, I got to put Linda back in. So Linda come down and settled us down a little bit. But overall, I thought everybody played hard. Everybody stepped up and... Uh, you know, that, that's a very good bass, but that's hard to, they're hard to guard. They dribble, penetrate. You know, I thought we did a decent job against their pressure for majority of the game. There was times we didn't because we got we weren't aggressive against it. But when we were aggressive against it, we was able to break it. Did you actively look not to shoot threes tonight? No. Well, you know, they play five guards. We, we felt until they brought in some post players, we can get to the rim. I mean, there was nobody there really protecting the rim. So I, you know, I, I felt that we could drive them, drive them, and, and, and our taller guards could, you know, get in there and make things happen. And, and then that's what they were able to do. Now we asked uh, Rhea, you know, yesterday if she had gotten over the Oklahoma and the fouls on driving the ball, whether she'd be tentative about doing tonight. She said, you know, I was over it Sunday. Yeah. Is she pretty much like that on most things? Yeah, I think so. I think so. Uh, you know, she she was very aggressive to the rim today. Made some nice moves around the rim. And, uh, you know, I thought, uh, you know, uh, Crystal Leary, seven offensive rebounds, was very active around the rim. I thought that was big for us, too. Give us more possessions, more shots, attempts. But, you know, we got a little bit out of control. Like I said, when we had the lead and a and, uh, little uh, bit passive, uh, not attacking their press. But uh, when we cut it to four, it was good to see that we come, we was able to build it back up to nine. It's been a while since Bria's had a game like this. How nice was it to see her kind of get back into that groove a little bit tonight? Well, it was great. It was great. Uh, you know, she come out aggressive. And, uh, you know, she has a green light. So, you know, we want her to be aggressive every game. So, you know, it was great to see. Coach, can you provide an assessment of Bree McDonald? I mean, you know, earlier in the season, she's just kind of trying to find her way. And now, I mean, it seems like a double-digit score almost every night. Yeah, she's found her way a little bit. You know, thing with her, we keep talking, just stay focused, stay focused, stay focused, stay focused. And, uh, you know, it's a 40-minute game. Sometimes, uh, not just her, some of our new players don't stay focused, especially defensively. And uh, those are things we got to continue to do, stay focused. You know, we got a lot of good teams coming up. We got to stay focused for four minutes or we're not going to beat them. Uh, Avery's in her fourth season here, and it seems like she's made a living off that foul line, foul line extended jump shot. It seems like teams continually don't get out there on them. Are you, are you surprised? I mean, well, I hope they keep doing it. But, you know, but, you know, she also, if you, if you, if you come at her and you're not sitting down, she can go around you. So, you know, I think at times when she reverse pivots out of that, she's pretty tough guard right there. Because she can shoot that jumper, like you said, and if you step up, she can go around you. She's able to put the ball on the floor and get to the rim. So, 
you know, she's been very consistent all year for us. Anything else, Coach? Coach, is that kind of the beauty of this conference? I mean, you know, you play so many good teams that, you know, you feel like your team's constantly going to get up for these games because you're playing good teams game in and game out. Um, you know, the way you started as to what you're playing like right now, I mean, provides plenty of opportunities to get back into Oh, absolutely. We've got a lot, excuse me, we've got a lot of good teams coming up that, uh, you know, anything can happen now. But, you know, we are playing better. So we got to continue to get better because we're going to play some better teams. And, uh, you know, if you look at the standings right now, we beat the number two and the number three here on our home floor. So, I mean, you know, we got some better teams coming in. We got to go on the road some more. So, you know, those type of things. But we got to continue to get better and starting tomorrow. Anything else? All right, thanks.